We introduced the definite integral as a means to calculate areas enclosed by a graph in straight lines. Well, here we may do the same thing uh, for uh, calculating the size of the areas enclosed by graphs of functions. So here we have two functions, g and f, and we want to calculate the size of a. Well, we may do the same thing. So we have the upper function f and the lower function g, and we may subdivide the interval a half uh, 1.2 over here a equals a half and b equals 1.2 and we may form so-called Riemann sums again so we try to approximate the area a by enclosed rectangles so here we see in the right hand picture right hand fig figure we see the rectangles which are again built upon uh, subdividing the interval in equal intervals and now we take as the height of a rectangle fxi star minus gxi star where xi star is something sampled from one of these smaller intervals just like we did for the definite integral so now we form sums uh, Riemann sums and uh, we may calculate the area spanned by the rectangles as fxi star minus gxi star times delta x and delta x is the length of such an interval and the height of each such, such in uh, a rectangle is given by fxi star minus gxi star so we sum over all those rectangles and uh, if we keep refining this procedure then we will get something that is close to the area A. So this will be something that we will elaborate on a little bit more because we can do the same thing for areas and later on we're going to apply the same ideas for volumes.